everybody. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to draw straight lines, straight horizontal and straight vertical lines. Okay, so let's get started. All right, in the last tutorial, we drew separate lines. All right, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to come up to the undo command and I'm going to undo some of that work. I'm just going to click undo a few times here until we get back to the beginning. All right, and now what I'm going to do is I'm going to start the line command. And as I start the line command, I'm going to come down to the status bar. All right, and on the status bar, you will have something that looks like a 90 degree angle. Um, and it's called ortho mode. So let's put that on. Let's make that blue. Okay. And now we'll just, again, we're going to pick with the mouse and we're going to start to draw a line. Now you should notice that whether your mouse wanders to the left or the right, it wants to draw a straight line. So I'm going to do another pick there. And there is a nice straight vertical line. Now we could draw another line segment either to the left or the right up or down so I want to come over to the right and pick I want to come up and pick I'm going to come over and pick down and so forth so you'll notice that all ortho does is restricts the cursor to straight lines just like the orthodontist straightens your teeth ortho in AutoCAD makes straight lines okay so when we're done with this, we can right click, okay? Um, and obviously we have some straight lines. Now I'm gonna undo this and I'm gonna draw straight separate lines. So I'm gonna come up to the line command and I'm gonna make sure that ortho is on, that undo turned it off, okay? So now my ortho mode is on and there's a straight line. I'm gonna right click to end the command and I'm going to right click to repeat. Okay. All right, and I can draw horizontal straight lines. Okay. What I'd like you to do is give that a try. And in the next tutorial, we're going to talk about units because we're actually going to start drawing lines to a specific length. Okay, so we'll get into units and we'll get into limits and I'll see you at the next tutorial.